and see pure and simple videos. Hey everybody, it's JR with JP Tech Tree. Um, just wanted to follow up with how the surface do you been doing. Um, it's been like four months now, or three to four months, and they had all the latest update. And as you guys can see, I still use it. It's holding up well. Uh, the skin from Soapy Guard still holding well. Um, of course, Microsoft Red Bumper st still solid and the skin the screen protection um, matte finish I get a couple of marks here from the pen usage and all that as far as the ports and all that no no issue with the port fingerprint reader Still good. Um, still smooth. You know, with all the latest update, latest firmware update, um, seems like they're still focusing with this. Uh, even though the, they announced the Surface Duo 2 coming out, you know, um, that looks like a nice machine. But this one here is, is still holding up well for what it does, and you know with the surface pan the slim design one still does the job as you can see still writes on it good still picking up really nice so that still does well um, and still has the magnet where you know you can put it on the side and still holding up well I put it in my pocket and hold up well on there and as far it goes fingerprint reader solid and again the gesture they really starting to improve the gesturing on these things here so thank you Microsoft um, I don't know how long they're gonna keep doing the updates but they promised that we're gonna get Android 11 on it um, by the end of the year or close to the end of the year as far as um, multitasking goes it still does well you know run two app and again this is one of the unique feature of the surface duo versus the foldables you know um, you, you can look up things here That way you can compare prices on, on what they're going for right now. You know, I I seen the Surface Duo go as low as uh, four hundred fifty dollars. You know, um, and then again, the gesture and all that is real quick. As far as the one screen operation, seems like with the Microsoft launcher they, they did improve it uh, much better um, not that much lag now so that really helps a lot and the way the way the way they utilize the two screen again it's, it's, it's like you have two separate things that you can do at the same time on on one side and then on the other side you can continue reading and then 
it's still lag on the certain things like when you do certain rotation and all that but it's not as bad as how it used to be so keep up the updates Microsoft and as far as speed and power um, still still work out good um, you, I can watch uh, YouTube on one side and then maybe a movie on one other side here no. And most of the things I notice is on the rubbing on the screen, it could be because of the matte finish. Um, if it was direct glass, it would be smoother, I notice. And that, that would be good. Again, multitasking, you can set it up true thing so you have um, YouTube on one side no. you can be watching uh, whatever you have on that side YouTube and play games So really, um, still, still doing well, um, especially with all the updates and all that. So that works out good. Um, watching, playing games. I'm not a good driver, but as you can see, you know, you can play game, watch video at the same time. A lot of these things here, it's got to do with the gestures, um, sliding and all that, and really, it's still solid um, with all the updates. They really still have it improved well, and I still love how the things slide over to the next one here. And as you can see, uh, holding up well. Um, again, this is just a quick follow up on how the surface do you is holding up um, it's almost end of the year already um, they just did the latest uh, firmware update and all that so basically all the updates and all that so I think the September was the latest one and still on Android 10, but you know, I was told we will get Android 11 and that should help. Um, I don't know if after you did all the updates and all that with the firmware and the Microsoft launcher, if you notice that it started to get warm here. Um, within five minutes, mine started to get warm. I don't know if you guys unit does get warm, but I noticed that and with the new Surface Duo coming out, it looks like they're going to improve the camera. Um, and that's a nice feature because now it's going to be external, so that, that really helps. So that way, you know, you can, you can see how well. So, again, thank you, Microsoft, um, for doing all the updates. Um, everything looking good. Um, still solid. No issue with the foldable design. Still fold nice. Um, my Sophie Skin Guard black camouflage still holding well. Um, 
Robert Guard from Microsoft, Red still doing good. Uh, screen, uh, matte, finish. You can see the scratches starting to come. Uh, you can wipe it down and it does go away, but you know, eventually it's time to change this. As far as the fingerprint reader go, it's still fast. And as far as the gesture now, um, they really got better. Remember in the beginning, we had so many lags, and it's like much better. Rotation still still have the issue with the lag when you rotate things, you know, as, as far it goes. And some of the phones, you know, it does lag when you rotate it a certain way. But anyway, uh, I just wanted to show you guys how the Surface Duo um, holding up um, as of October 7. Uh, with all the latest update, the firmware was the September update. Microsoft Launcher just recently got updated too. And as far it goes, um, this baby's still holding fine. And, you know, if you get the Surface pen even the regular pen works good so but I find that this one here it's much smoother when it's riding you know with the surface pen the regular one um, wasn't as smooth so I got rid of that one there um, this one here the flat one you know works nice and I think this might work with the Surface A2. Um, still thinking about that. I'm thinking about getting the uh, Surface Duo 2, but again, I have to see how that one goes. Um, if we wait for it, um, probably come cheap like this one too. But I'm very surprised how smooth the pen is on this thing you know, when you when you're taking notes or doing drawing really uh, it's hard to justify how smooth it is on the camera but really it's very smooth um, and pretty detail as you guys can see in that you know. um, anyway um, that's just a quick one I wanted to share with you guys since I haven't posted some video because my job changes and then again apologize for the noise because I do everything in my basement I don't have a studio um, so you probably hear background sounds and all that but I'll keep you guys up to date on how Microsoft is doing with the original one and if I do get the Surface Duo 2 I'll link I'll do an update on that and again thank you for all the support for the subscriber and the people that do a comment and if you're new subscribe you'll see other things on it I just did an iPad Magic Keyboard video on that uh, I might do um, Samsung Galaxy Flip 3 video soon and then I had some comments that they wanted to see uh, my Super 73 video on that um, that's probably gonna be a separate channel but again thank you for everybody's patience and now that everything's starting to get back to normal I'll make more videos um, anyway if you like the video give me a thumbs up I'll take thumbs down too and enjoy reading you guys comment catching up with everybody's comment uh, be safe and for now Aloha